we've got to have that same stability if we want to get people working again here in the state of Wisconsin. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Too many years, too many politicians in the state, quite frankly, across this country, that ignore the reality that many of our governments are broke. The best way to fix it is to take head on the challenges we face here in the state of Wisconsin. And certainly, other states, particularly international or across the country. is at risk. I think there are people in this country that want to take away every right uh, to organize a union that anybody has. I think there are people that want to cut all public workers to the bone. And if we don't stand up, we're all going to get squashed like a bug. So. This is what democracy looks like! Oh, it's a shame what's happening. It's about time that people woke up. Um, I think everybody stands a chance of this. When you become complacent, uh, bad things happen. And uh, I mean, I definitely think that uh, Chicago would stand up. We're a very strong Union City, and I don't think they'd get away with it. But I mean, you don't even want it to come come to light. You know, you don't want this to even come. To it's, it's a shame it has. This, I think, is the most important issue going on in the country at the moment. And I think that it's a it's a clash between. The people that are trying to wipe out the middle class with things like breaking the union and you know getting rid of the possibility we say yes of um, to union, union backing and you know, politics. We say yes to NPS. I am supporting uh, the teachers that gave me my education, that allowed me to get into school, um, and I also stand with the union workers of this state and around the world. You know, we here, the people of Wisconsin, are standing with others around the country. I would be willing to go to Chicago to show my support there. I, I will drive around the Midwest. I, it, I'm proud to be a part of this movement.